All right, hey guys, my name is Manuel. And my name's Anish. And we're here to tell you about our project, uh, our MP7. This is uh, our game. We had a game website, and uh, Anish is going to tell you about it. All right, so basically if you go to this URL, you can basically get to this website. Now, this website has two main tabs, the About Us tab and the Game tab. Now, on this main screen right here, there's, the, there's a game and how to play. Um, if you first go to the About Us tag, all right, so you can basically look through, go see um see all of our names all the contributors of this website if you have any more questions you can email us but uh here's the about us but more importantly is the game and so if you go to the game uh tab which will take you to this new window right here you can actually click here to play now the main gist of this game is that you know, a circle will pop up randomly you click on the circle and every time you click on it the circle will start to shrink and the objective is to basically click on the circle as much as many times as possible uh, before it shrinks and the difficulty about this game is that it starts to shrink faster and faster every time you click on the circle eventually to the point where it will get extremely hard so after you end the game you'll have your score which will show you the number of clicks now the code behind it is also uh, shown here um, so this HTML is basically the index HTML goes over what we wrote and the CSS page is how we styled it now we mainly used grid now grid was really helpful in, in which we could format the individual aspects of this website make it extremely organized and um, we could play around with the individual features but now Manuel is going to go over the game and the HTML and the JavaScript behind it yeah so we coded this game using JavaScript uh, the HTML and CSS for this page uh, is pretty simple it's all just about a circle and uh, styling for the circle, which, you know, obviously to make a circle you use border radius, right? And uh, JavaScript is where the magic happens, of course. We got the document and uh, pick out, picked out the circle, had our, all, of, all our variables to make this work. We have two main functions that are the most important here. We have the position circle and the shrink circle. Position circle uh, puts the circle somewhere randomly on the screen. It takes the coordinate, or it takes the width of the window, the inner window, and uh, finds a random coordinate for it. And then it'll go ahead and run through. and. Uh, It'll run this do while loop, which will set the inter uh, It'll run this function called set interval, which will run shrink circle every one hundredth of a second. Shrink circle is the other function. It uh, go ahead and it it shrinks the circle by one pixel uh, times a logarithmic click count every divided by a thousand. It's really just trying to make it as easy as possible for people to use, uh, to play the game because it's actually pretty dang hard. Uh, down here, you can see the event listeners for the clicks. Every time you click, it'll run position circle, which will go ahead and run shrink circle. And uh, every time you click, it'll also count your click so that we can give you your score later. And uh, that's basically the gist of it. It's pretty simple. It's very nice, and it's a really fun game. Great. Go ahead and check us out whenever you uh, feel the need.